Hi, how's it going? My name is Noah. And if you are new to my channel, then I bet you are probably wondering why the fuck is this bitch wearing five layers of makeup at 9.34 in the morning? Is that mirrored? That's a really good question. The answer is because I'm You're insecure. <laughs> I have to preface by saying that I've already seen this. Um, not all of it. I don't think I've seen all the episodes, to be honest. I think I've seen up until episode 11, maybe, of the first season. And now I'm just going to rewatch the whole thing because, well, a number of reasons, right? Number one is because it's a local, like here, it's from the Philippines. I'm also from the Philippines. It's the first local BL series that... I kind of enjoy so I don't know I wanted to spread the word about this and not that it's not already popular I'm pretty sure this shit's popping all by itself like Game Boys is doing well um, they're already approved for a second season Pearl next door I struggled a bit there don't do the close-up on the lips I hate it when you do that I'm just kidding I'm talking to myself by the way I also edit my own videos side note um, second reason is because to my knowledge ideal first company ideal idea hold on idea first company subscribe to them um, I'm subscribed there's your proof oh I didn't like the okay shit idea first company to my knowledge is more lenient when it comes to copyright and that's a hell yeah from me obviously and then um i also plan on seeing pearl next door if or when it comes out not well not if it is gonna come out we're all coming out this season i'm probably a, a bit late because this ended a little ways back but that's fine because you know what they say better late than straight let's start Oh, whoa. I'm watching this for the first time with headphones on. Because the first time I saw most of the entire first season, I watched it with my best friend. The fucking background noise is so much louder than I'd realized. This is Kai. I remember him. I honestly don't like if you've tried to figure out what the fuck is he playing. Let's try to figure out together. Okay, so we're hearing like electricity of some sort. It sounds like a locomotive. I'm gonna guess that this is a game about a train that's going way too fast and you're on the train and then you have to fight the people inside it. I feel like this game is trained to the sun. I'm gonna bet money on that. Cairo just got owned. Oh, Cairo is his name. I right, Kai. I got Kai on the brain. Okay, Lila. Whoa. Oh my god, I just. So guys, I'm so stupid. I was playing that without the subtitles. I'm sorry. <laughs> Ooh. We're gonna find out, aren't we? Gabriel Alert Con. Angel 2000. Hey. Hey. Confirms based on pictures. Who can relate? Hi, Kim Amazing. Good game. Angel 2000. <laughs> <laughs> Who does that? Like who? You just added this guy immediately. Immediately. You send him a message. Kind of creepy, but okay. And then does a video call right away? Where is this confidence coming from, Gab? Like, where do I find that? I haven't found it for all 30 years of my life. I don't think I'm going to stumble upon it at 31 or something. On top of that, like, can you buy it at Shopee? I need to know. Also, how did he call? How did you call him? Like, how? <laughs> how is that possible? Like, you started the video call, took a nap, got up. It was like, oh, hey, it worked. Hi. No, I'm just naked. Awesome. Yeah! I'm so happy. Galing. Listen, I don't know how this is translating to people. Like, if this is too much. 
even in Tagalog, it is kind of too much. But at the same time, I think there's like a more playful nature to it when it's spoken in Tagalog. But when it's translated in English, because I'm seeing these captions too, and I'm like, girl, what's that? I don't even know why I'm reading the captions. I can understand it. But still, when I read how it's translated, I'm like, that's so much worse. It's so much creepier in English. Because <laughs> like in, in Filipino, it doesn't it doesn't flow that same way. Mm. Another thing that I wanted to mention that I liked about these two actors is that they looked more natural together. Like their chemistry was much more organic as opposed to oh no i don't want to say the name as opposed to the other bl series that was running alongside this in my personal opinion okay i'm not trying to start a war here i'm just saying like that's one of the reasons why i flock towards this more because i like the the chemistry between the two actors <laughs> this is brother London in five years to those of you that have seen this who the fuck was recording Cairo here Sinian si Paris but because we never saw Paris for the entirety of the first season spoiler in the Lazaro family there are three siblings there's Kai Cairo uh London and then there's Paris who I think is the the youngest there's also this whole thing about his dad that's going to be revealed later and it's I don't know maybe I should set like a proper trigger warning because it's yeah it gets deep she gets serious oh I didn't notice that there was a family picture there in in vgram <laughs> Oh, here, to the left, yeah. So there's the dad. And then, this is London. Oh, this is Paris. This is mom. And that's Cairo. And I think, like, when I... <laughs> like, by Paris, Lazaro. This is the most that he's ever contributed. This is his one line in the entire season. I think, also, when I read up on um, how things were on set... Because I really did enjoy this. The first time I saw it and I was done. Or I thought I was done by 11 episodes. I, I found out that the father, the actor here that plays Kaido's father, is his father in real life. The initial stalking period, we enjoy. Only one of them knows how to properly wear a shirt. I feel like that's incredibly important in a pairing between two boys and two girls. I mean, you know what? It's 2020. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. You hear that, guys? Only loved ones and significant others can call him Cairo. Does that remind you of a certain someone that we know? Huh? Anyone? So, what you to this could be my entire reaction to this, to this rewatch. It's just me being incredibly disappointed and at the same time impressed. I'm depressed. You ever been so just in awe of a person? He flirts like he breathes. It's just a thing. It's just a thing that he does. Literally none of his followers are asking. None of them. <laughs> From the few minutes that we've been watching this, oh no, not a few minutes, it's almost over. Oh yeah, some of these episodes are super short. But from the 9 minutes and 24 seconds that we've seen so far, can any of you guess what the condition is? I don't know. Yes, I don't know. 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 I Here's my whole thing that I enjoy about this. In the very beginning, there was no establishment of sexuality. Like, Gav just was. <laughs> Gav just is what he is. And then with Cairo, I think later on in the in the season, there's a bit more 
discussion about his sexuality but i like that it's so easy it's so calm there's nothing like overly complicated about how the two of them started and the biggest driver of this plot so far is Gabriel just going at it full force 200 percent they're both lenjan is what i'm guessing none of these people are weibushan not even gab bro if you thought that weibushan had like no subtlety whatsoever have you met gab <laughs> every time he sees Cairo, he looks like he's about to cry and absorb him all at the same time. It's like all he wants is a hug. He just wants to be touched. That's the face of a man that's just looking to be touched. How sad in a pandemic where we're supposed to be isolating ourselves because touching other people and being way too close could literally kill you. How fucking tragic. <laughs> Wait the fuck a minute. Why I keep watching this too is just so that we can introduce Pearl. Like get Pearl into the picture. Y'all don't know who Pearl is yet. And your lives are sad. It is lacking. And you need Pearl. You need some Pearl in you.